Alrighty, hello ladies and gentlemen, here we are getting ready to kick up another game of Rocket League tonight where we will head over to the US West servers and we will find the matchup between LMU JV Blue versus Season 7 No Mercy. For that, we can start up a prediction on this one, see who will end up taking this series going forward. That way, if anyone wants, they can throw out a guess. It is more than encouraged, as we greatly appreciate people showing active, being active, and chilling in the stream. So. We will start that prediction on upwards. 15 minutes on that one. 15 minutes until about game should be starting on up. With that being said, <clears throat> as long as everything is a go with the players, we will be good then. Otherwise, we are able to go early. We have finished up casting earlier tonight. We can go through this where we had Phantom versus Amigos earlier today. Phantoms able to close out that series. An intense thriller went the whole distance all the way, even to overtime in Game 7, where Phantoms were able to just slide on by Amigos. Just shortly a while ago, we had some 2v2 US East action, Tier 2, Division 2. The St. Louis 50 Kings versus Continental. St. Louis 50 Kings looking like they were on fire in that one. Able to wrap that game on up in for playing lights out as they then are heading on to their three matchup now but then below that one we had 3v3 us west server which is our game coming up we will have tier 4 division 6 season 7 no mercy versus lmu jv blue that one is coming up at the half hour mark and then following that one on up we head back over to the us east servers for some more 2v2 we stay in tier 4 as we are in division 14 where Ronan will be taking on Team Alation Pink to wrap out our night in an hour and a half from the start of this first game. <clears throat> Just to start diving into this one, this 3v3 LMU, JV Blue, Munchies, Novanella, and Anthony taking on Nettles, Mitch, Brian, Andy Shifting, Color Dino. It's Season 7, No Mercy of 1UP Gaming versus LMU JV Blue. LMU JV Blue finding the way to get it done defensively from the looks of it as they are managing only 1.62 goals per game, putting up 2 saves and .67 assists, and that is enough to keep them at 6-0 and heading into this game. Well, Season 7, No Mercy looking like they like to play a bit more balanced style where they have 2.4 goals per game, 2.24 saves per game, and 1.48 assists per game. <clears throat> Coming up shortly with that, we will leave this on up there. That way everyone can try to be their analyst with the predictions and make any predictions that they think they might expect to see in this upcoming game. <clears throat> but... We will just keep jumping back and forth between the bracket and that as talked about here. These guys are going to go on to play the winner of the winner will play super fast loss or felony assault. Whichever team ends up finalizing that series on out and they will meet them in the finals and then the loser of that will play the loser of that series so so forth for third place. We are now to the point where it is a best of sevens, and you are guaranteed both these series, as you see, because the loser of seven versus the loser of eight is the bronze match. In order to get here, it looks like LMU, JV, Blue ended up having to not really put too much on against it, as they did end up having where their opponent looked like they got DQ'd. So that will make it where LMU, JV, Blue coming to this one relatively fresh in playoffs. No knowledge of how they are going to perform, but Season 7, No Mercy, ending up taking on the Butternut Squanches, who is another team that I ended up having to cast earlier this year. And they ended up taking the 3-1 series there. 
as they move on to play LMU JV Blue tonight. <clears throat> this will definitely be an interesting one as we then will get to see how this one plays on out. If we look at the other side of the bracket, super fast loss, take the game that they're supposed to be expected against the Aces and Spades in a 3-0 sweep. But then as they run into the two seed, they actually pulled off the upset, finding a 3-2 win over Dunk City to pull themselves to it. And then in the three versus six, another looks like, and it was a great series where Felony Assault ends up locking in the win Upsetting mechanically mediocre in game five yet again. As we head on to it tonight, though, tonight is best of seven, so you will need to find yourself being the first one to four games. As we ideally kick that one off here in about 10 minutes. Back to it one more time, just to kind of get the display of how these teams typically like to play on out. We end up typically seeing Season 7, No Mercy, putting up about 2.5 goals and saves per game. And about more often than not, that goal is assisted, but it's not by much more than about 50% of the time they end up assisting that goal. <clears throat> LMU JV Blue, though, on the other side of this. Having it where they come into this one, as I said, looking like a very defensive or stably passing team as they typically get it done in low scoring games where it's one to two goals per game out of them and about two saves per game as well. And they end up finding the assist a little bit less than half the time. So it feels like they are really willing to make you need to try to work around them. And you might end up being the one passing them the ball in certain circumstances. But obviously we will only get to see that tonight as they do not have a playoff game played before this one they ended up finding their buy directly into this game here and I can try to double check the servers to see if there is any update on that one I do not know if it would be updated yet but we can at least look in to seeing whether or not there's any new news on who ended up moving on from the other side of the bracket to know who will be playing to who will be playing against who in the championship or if this will be the first knowledge of it It does look like that other game is still up for grabs. So nobody was able to finalize that one on out yet. So this will be the first time that we will be seeing about how that one, how who will be fighting for the championship. Holy. <laughs> Guess I'm a bit tired on the day right now. But that being said, no reason to stop us going forward. We definitely will try and make sure that we can continue this, get this underway shortly, have it where we get all the teams up in here and get us good to go. <clears throat> we will just sit up on here as we are about five minutes to the top of the hour. Six and one, season seven, no mercy versus LMU JV Blue.
as we are trying to be able to get this one underway, we will see shortly. As talked about, uncertain as to who they will be playing, but winner of this game moves on to the finals. Loser ends up playing for third place. We got season. I keep saying season seven, no mercy, but it might stand for something else. But no mercy up against LMU JV Blue. With that, as talked about a lot, we have LMU as the one seed. No mercy as the four seed. LMU comes into this one six and oh. No mercy comes into this one six and one. If you look through the playoff bracket, the thing to catch your eye is this is LMU's first playoff matchup that they actually will be partaking in. This will definitely be something to uh, kick it off as I believe when I look back through it. And if you look through the bracket, you will see the DQs. Felony Assault won their game versus Super Fast Loss. So the winner of this one goes on to play up against Felony Assault. Thank you so much for that update. Big Basses, that definitely is helpful. It makes it where you can fully fill in this bracket at this point. <clears throat> so, winner is looking to try to take on Felony Assault in that finals. Well, the loser is going to end up matching up against Super Fast Lost in the battle for third place. As we head on back to this one, I've talked about it a bit. We'll run through it one more time for everyone who's new to the lobby but we have it where alrighty so you ended up playing it so you're coming here to try to find out who you guys will be taking on I understand entirely then we had that happen earlier tonight between in uh, some 2v2 action in tier 2 division 2 where uh, a team also gave me the update of this is who they will be playing next week so that is what we have going but season Seven, no mercy, up against LMU JV Blue. LMU JV Blue coming in this one off the disqualifications earlier. And no mercy finding the 3 1 win over the Butternut Squanches in their last matchup to pull themselves into this one. So we are looking to ideally get this one underway as soon as we can get players all up in the lobby. But <clears throat> we will wait on that one. Well, thank you guys for uh, hanging on out with me then as we get to get into this one. As you guys are definitely looking to see who you guys will be taking on and how you're expecting it to go. Some S7 fans joining into this one. I will be double checking right now. All right, S7 says they will be joining in three minutes. <clears throat> Once they end up joining, if we don't have the other team as well, that is when I will reach on out to them too to try to make sure we definitely can get this game underway. It's no rush to me as I do have at least one more after this tonight, so I am completely fine. Even if we end up kicking this one off a little late. <clears throat> but ideally we do want to be able to kick that off around those scheduled times. Make sure that everyone has their fair chances. And that we can get our Rocket League underway. Some Tier 4 Division 6 action on the US West server 3v3. A lot of the viewers here understand what's going on. Winner of this one does get to go on and play up against felony assault in the finals so that is the goal for both these teams here tonight to prove that they are going to be there and that they want to take it all s seven's correct all right as long as their warm-ups are going that way then good to hear it Ideally, LMU can at least give us a good series with them and make it where we can see both these teams playing some of their best Rocket League.
as I'm just back and forth and making sure everything is fine with people getting in the lobby. I know last one I might have had a small mistake on what I put out there for the captains, but they were able to figure it out and they got up in there anyway. So all worked out. In to this one we find color dino which means a seven is getting into this lobby I will need to see from here because I might be I will quick reach on out to the other team make sure that they are fine to get up into this lobby and that there are nothing nothing making a mistake there so <clears throat> wanting to just make sure I have had it in the past where That is definitely odd, but I believe that's who I'm supposed to be at. And I don't know if they have their warm-up game going on or what. Technically, they do have on it tell at least 10 minutes after the designated time to get up in here we are definitely willing to wait As if I wasn't mistaken, the other group team was in a private match. We will see what they have coming for me. It's not working. Not sure why. See you on this one. They're trying to figure out how to get this into the lobby. Yep, all right, there we are. We have them up in here just to make sure we have the time on everything. Looks like we should be good to get this one underway. I like to always let them uh, tell me, though, that they're good. Because <clears throat> that way we know we are fine. But we should be about ready to get this underway. Kicking off, season S7, no mercy, up against LMU JV Blue. The one versus the four. This is the expected matchup for tonight. <clears throat> I think we have everyone.
All right, let's see. All, both these teams, yes, you are good to join. Go, go, go. All right, it looks like we have our three. A side kickoff looks even. We should be good to go. S7, no mercy. Here's LMU, JV, blue. Here we go. Off that kickoff. Back into the blue side corner. Munchies trying to take up. Pass one. Pass out across. Not quite able to tuck that one away. And on out this one goes. Nemani trying to play it up and over out towards that center. But Nettles does well to push this one on out. Ryan Brown pushing this one on down towards the center. Meeting up with Sparkno back on out. This one 50s in with the blue side corner. Munchies tries to take this one, but Nettles is back on out as Sparkno flips back in the corner. Brian Brown playing back on out, leaving it for Color Dino. Met by Sparkno and back in the corner. Munchies trying to get that center touch, not quite finding it. Namani and Nettles meet up, making sure that he not find the back of the net quite yet. Spark no back off this corner looking for the center for Munchies. Nettles as well to push it on out. Actually ends up coming towards the goal. And the body not quite able to get back in time. And no mercy find themselves up one. 56 seconds into game one. Back to that kickoff line we go. Spark no meeting up with Brian Round. Munchies pushing it on forward. Color Dino diving in, firing a shot. And looks like he is able to find the back of the net with that one. Is US West. Had to make sure of it just to double check. Color Dino finding himself with a laser just able to beat Nemani in the back of the net. Two goal lead for S7, no mercy. Probably just gonna say no mercy as that makes more sense. I want to say season seven, otherwise, I'm too used to that beating it. Brian Brown in a rule one with Spark Note now. Will they break it? Nettles playing to the center. Color Dino, but Munchie tries to push on out. Not quite able to do so. So Nettles will find the goal, and Brian out of his rule one finds himself getting an assist. An unfortunate start here, but LMU is going to need to try to find a way to bounce back. Good start if you are the S7 No Mercy fan. Back to that center line. Sparknote and Brian Brown. This one does come back on down. Sparknote off that back wall. Nemani diving in. Meeting up with Nettles. Up this one plays. Nettles hitting on outwards. Munchies tries to take low, but Brian Brown able to at least throw this one back on out. Nemani back in the side corner where Color Dino tries to play this one on outwards. Brian Brown pushing it forward. Spark now back to that sidewall. Tries to take some possession and play on out. 50 with Nettles back in the side half. It goes Munchies up for it. Gets a soft touch back down. Brian Brown able to at least get a good clearance on it. Back on out. Color Dino trying to get there as it actually draws for Nettles. Nettles off the pipe. Not quite able to find his way to the net on that one. Spark now trying to take up dribble pass one. Bringing it in the blue side corner. Trying for the center pass another. But is it able to be there? No. Color Dino with the clearance. Munchies going back out of this corner, looking for the center. Hits it back on a cross. Nettles now leaving it for Color Dino. Color Dino playing on to the orange side corner. Playing high, not finding the touch to get it to the center. So Munchies will possess it on out. Pass one, trying to get past another 50. Brian Brown into the towards the center. This goes. Brian Brown at least getting back. This one on up the wall. Continues with another touch. Drops it down for Nettles. Nettles firing, but it's once again just wide. Spark no. Back on out. Spark no playing across, but doesn't quite find it. Munchies now looking at it. Trying to find Brian Brown. Kamani trying to come back across. Not able to connect, but no one does. So this does just end up rolling across the front of the net. Brian trying to find it ends up just high. Munchies with the first touch on it. Plays on out. Spark no getting to this one. Trying to play on it. Gets one touch with Nettles back to the side. Munchie just off the sidewalk, trying to find a pass towards the center to one of his teammates. Soft touch past the oncoming blue defender, trying to find another demo played by Nettles with the opening back on up. Color Dino trying to come back across. Nettles playing to that sidewalk. Mani is it there and tries to play on out, whereas Munchie is just pushing it back in that blue side corner, but Brian Brown launches this one back in the orange side now. Munchies over Brian Brown. Trying to bring it back on himself. 
not able to find it. Nettles keeps on this one and it advances. Munchies with a soft push. Ends up 50 as this pops on up high, but Color Dino able to advance it back into the orange side. Munchies trying to get that touch. Ends up meeting Nettles and it 50 back across. Left on the clock. This one goes on out toward midfield. Spark Note, Color Dino. Spark Note able to get the inside shot, but Nettles sitting at that net. Not allowing anything to fall through. Munchies playing back towards that corner. Mani now looking to try to center this one across. Looks like he can. And Munchies is there to confirm. Get his LMU their first goal of this series. Still need two more to come back into this game. With 42 seconds remaining. It is still possible. Just a hard task to come by. So back to that center line we go. Nettles and Mani meeting up. Up this goes Munchie, he's trying to get a touch on it, and he does, and it's actually a very good touch, and goes far down and in. Munchie's on the bounce shot, finding a way to put that one away. Just underneath the crossbar, pulling LMU back to within one. 36 seconds remain. Back to that kickoff line, Munchie's met by Color Dino, and it plays on the one side half. Back across goes Nettles, finds the opening and converts though, giving no mercy that goal lead yet again. Back to the center line, we take this one. Sparknote and Brian Brown. Kicks back into that orange side corner, out of the orange side corner, and Munch is trying to play off that side ball. Nettles able to meet it there. Nemani now up for Munchies. Munchies pushing it onwards further. Brian Round hitting this one on out to Color Dino, who fires the shot but ends up wide. Able to try to get back to it, but Munchies with this with a demo play to not allow him to continue anything. Nemani back off that sidewalk. Nettles now looking for the center. Munchies hits on out, but it does end up falling there. But she's in set S7, no mercy. Find themselves with game one. No mercy, putting themselves up one. One of the needed four. <laughs> Still looking like it could be any one series as LMU found their stride a little bit later in that game. But obviously no mercy trying to just show that while they might have found their stride, they can continue on with the gameplay that they showed here in game one. If Color Dino has million numbers of fans, you are one of them. If Color Dino has 10 fans, you are one of them. And if Color Dino has no fans, that means you are no longer on the earth. If the world's against Color Dino, you are against the world. Well, that is one committed Color Dino fan that we have in the chat. And I will let you know right now, Color Dino, you definitely have a fan base for you. But Munchies now trying to fire this one across. Not quite finding his way on target. Nettles finding that demo and trying to play on outward. Getting to this and he's firing it towards the net. Spark Note with a good touch to not allow the oncoming attacker to put this one away. Into the blue side we go. Color doing well to push this back into the orange side corner. Here we find Spark Note trying to find the play on it. Ends up dropping down into Mani. Mani beating Brian around, but Brian getting better taking it on. Plays on out, Munchies off that sidewall, looking to try to get something started. Color at least able to dissuade it, but Sparkno tries to follow this one on into the corner, but Nettles will be able to take some possession there. Met by Nemani and Brian now off that sidewall. Nemani backflipping into this one, trying to get theirs. It leaves it for Munchies, and Munchies over one, but Ryan is back, which ends up dunking, but not quite able to keep it below the crossbar. So out this one goes. Sparkno down the 50 with Brian around, and back out it plays. Color now off that side wall trying to play on downwards. Metal not finding the connection there. Munchie's trying to find something for his own good flick, but it's a crossbar. Is it going to find its way into the net? He's wailing out, and Sparkno comes in with a shot, but Brian was able to keep that one on out. The defensive stand there from No Mercy to keep this one all tied at zeros. It just pops on up. Munchie's now playing on outwards, and across this one finds itself. Plays on out, Manji looking for it. Centers for Munchies. Munchies dropping a long shot back on out. It's falling as he plays to that far side corner. 
looks like. Namani is not going to be able to get much on it as Color Dino plays onwards. Color Dino trying to find it himself, and he does as it falls off the wall, and he is able to split the defense. The Color Dino fan is going to be pretty happy on that one in Flip Out and Hamster Quest. As their man finds himself a goal. Back to that center line. Color Dino and Munchies. This one popped back on out. Namani firing off that sidewall. Down for Sparkle. Spark no. Ends up not quite getting it. Nettles plays in the far side. Corner. Munchies pops this one on out and high. Mani on a redirect back across. Trying to find Spark no. Met by Nettles. Pitches back in the blue side corner. Munchies off that sidewall. Coming to the center. Namani trying to fire something. Ends up playing back in the corner. Met where Nettles plays on a demo. Diving on in, trying to get the center, but Brian Round not allowing him to do so. Mounty playing on downwards. Spark note now finding a shot ends up just on wide. Mounty trying to find another one, plays towards the center, but Brian Round finds it. Up Munchies drops it back down. Brian trying to get back there, ends up finding his way past one, but Mounty with the clearance on it. Munchies pushing on in the blue side half, off the back wall now. Oh, Dino trying to push it on outwards. At least met by Color Dino as he pushes it even further forward. Spark note off the back wall and outwards. Ryan Round takes it here. Looking for it off the back wall. Trying to double up and does so nicely to give no mercy a two goal lead. Knew that he could get back up to it and he does well to do so. No mercy, just a team of Giga Chads. They are correct. Well, they are at least playing good Rocket League here right now. Oh, this one pops. Munchies firing a shot towards goal. Trying to make sure Brian almost had to save. But Munchies doing well on the follow-up. And dunking the defender to, to keep LIMUJB in this game. As he ends up putting that one away. Back to within one. A minute 53 remaining. Off that kickoff. Bonnie and Nettles. Munchies tries to pop it, pops over one. But Color Dino able to push this one on out to the side. So we'll play so it's center. Namani firing a shot, but Nettles is back and does well to deal with it. Up Color Dino going for this one, but not looking like he was able to find it. So Nettles ends up finding it when it drops and playing back on towards that center. Brian trying to fire a shot, not finding his way to net. Namani of Gucci did not allow Color Dino shot to make it in there. Munchies pushing onwards. 50s with Brian and up this goes, but Nettles able to push it back on out. Sparkno takes the ball after Munchies demos Nettles. Sparkno looking for that center, but Brian dissuading this one. Munchies taking low, trying to flick past one, but Color gets a good enough piece of that, not allow it to find anything. Mani and Nettles 50 onward, it goes. Color off that sidewall. Nimani playing back on out. Munchies with a pop, but it ends up popping over one and away. Nettles looking like he is in front of it. Brian Brown trying to get a touch on it. Not quite finding it, but the demo from Nettles makes where the net is open anyway. So they will put that away. A two goal lead for no mercy. As they certainly aren't trying to show any of it in this series early on the demo on the last defender to make sure they put that one away. 50 seconds still remains though. Nettles playing onto that side wall. Decides to wait on this touch for Munch. She's playing on forward. Munch not quite able to get back to it. Color Dino playing on out. Spark now back to the corner. Nettles playing on out cross. Munchies up for it. Off the back wall and down it will fall. Who will find it? Namani flying in there to dunk the defender and give LMU another chance in this game to pull back even as they are now only down by one. 32 seconds remain. Back at that center line. Nettles and Nemani. This one plays off to the side. Ryan off the back wall. And out this one is taken by Nemani. Nemani looking for something. Leaves it for Spark Note as they fire a shot. Nettles is right there for it. Munchies is up. Munchies trying to drop it for Brian. It will make the save on it. Color hit this one on out. Nemani now firing. But Nettles once again pushing it back towards that corner. Spark Note now trying to take the ball. Gets on to it, playing towards the center. Brian hits on out. Namani popping off that sidewall. Not quite able to find it. Nettles drops it there. No mercy. Find themselves with two early games. 
the two early games in this one. Are they able to keep their momentum or are LMU able to swing this series? Color Dino having all of the fans in the chat. Everyone is for this man. Last time I think I casted this team, I believe Nettles was under the name I was reloading. But yes, the Color Dino fans are very happy for this, uh, the current path of things. You guys still love Nettles and Brian too, but it's just Dino's got that next step where he gets the love on the stream. It's all good though. We are all here for it. Season 7, No Mercy trying to take game 3. LMU trying to swing this series back into their favorite. Brian off to kick off. Firing one towards the net. Spark going as well. Does play it on outwards. Nettles taken to the air. Met by Munchie. Does well to keep it on out. But Dino firing a shot. And it will beat defender. Color Dino able to put this one away. Only 11 seconds has passed to get through this one. As the kickoff progressed relatively quickly. And No Mercy find themselves up one yet again. They don't have enough love to go around for everyone, but Color Dino got the first copy bust of the night. I love it. Really love to hear it. Brian playing towards the center, not quite able to get back to it. So as the orange defense does well to push this one away, Monty up for Munchies. Munchies popping his back on up for Sparknote. Sparknote off the back wall. Color Dino does well to play this one on away. Monty not quite able to get to it for Color. Pushing on off that back one out. Brian almost making an insane read on it. Nettles now popping one high. Is it able to find its way under the crossbar? Not quite able to do so much. He clears this on out. Looking to advance this on into the blue side corner. Off the blue side corner wall. Color ended up catching it. Back on down. Munchies off that back wall. But dealt with. Where did these come back across? Monty popping back on high. Sparkno trying to push go up for it. Color Dino takes the touch first. 50 by Munchies towards the center. It'll fall. But Nettles does well push this one on away. Nimani back into the corner. And out in comes with Nettles and does well push it on away. Nettles taking up the dribble now. Nimani flipping back into it, not allowing that to continue. And off the side wall. This ends up being taken from Munchies, dropping it on down. Pass Nettles trying to keep up with it off that back wall. And out with Color Dino dumping all over that one. Nimani finding the boost that they were needing. But the pass to the center, Nettles not quite able to get it. It's in a just wide. Sparknote hits this one onto that side and plays on outwards. Munchies out of the corner now, trying to find it towards the center of a color dino. It will be there. Mani back in the corner where Nettles plays off of that sidewalk. Brian Mount dropping it towards the center. Sparknote popping this one on high off that back wall. Up for it. Munchies trying to, but not quite finding it. Namani now trying to play back on out over everyone and puts it away, tying this one back up. Just about three minutes remaining. Mani converting on the aerial. Defense not quite thinking it was going to end up finding its way underneath the crossbar. Nimani and Ryan Round meeting back up to the center and Munchies ends up pushing it onwards. She's not quite able to get the touch, so Color Dino does well clear. Munchies looking for a pass. He man decides to fake on it, but it falls down. Nettles trying to play on out now. Mani pushing onwards. Brian round. Mani back to Brian with flip over one, but Mani once again pushing it on wide. Pops it up over the blue defender. Meets Nettles and out. This one shoots with Spark Nose with a pass. A but Brian round was able to intercept, not allow anything there. Munchie's dropping it back on down. This one comes across and Mani pushes this one back on outwards. Color Dino dropping it back down. Across this one plays, and Imani needs to take off that sidewalk. Spark Note ends up being met by Dino, and oh, this one comes Brian off the sidewalk yet again. Spark Note playing back towards the center. And this ends up being left for Munchies, where he takes back across and tries to fire this one back in the blue side corner. Out of the blue side corner, Color Dino trying to take high. Pass one, pass two, 50 with Imani. Back down, this one drops. Nettles trying to push this one onwards. And demos are trying to be happening here. Namani just takes this one high and over. Met by Color Dino off that back wall. 
Spark Nose does not find it. Color Dino is still trying to drop it down for Nettle, but once he does well, puts this one away and wide. Trying now, firing one that ends up high and across. Tries to get back to it, and it ends up being enough. Brian puts this one away. A two to one lead to no mercy. Ends up fighting it just over his spark note. It's an unfortunate backflip there. Back to the center line. Nettles finding the demo on Spark Note, but he did push this one forward to the blue side corner. Monty trying to get back to it, but Nettles able to pop this one on outwards. Spark Note back down, he plays. Nettles trying to take possession in his own corner. Out it goes. Nettles finds his way by to Brian, trying to play past another, and ends up going straight towards the net. Brian finding another goal here, but no mercy up two with a minute nine remaining. Back to that center line, Brian and Damani. This one pops on. Oh, Munchies. He's pushing onwards, but Nettles now grabbing possession of it, trying to take the dribble. Damani ends up possessing it there. Trying to play on out. Not quite able to find it. And they end up left for Brian, but a great save by Spork. No, keep this one on out of the net. Color off the back wall, playing down towards the center. Munchies decides to catch it here. 50 with Nettles that ends up going relatively in his favor, but Color Dino able to take it from there. Pinched on across high and down this one falls. Munchies off the back wall. And Nettles flying in. Able to find it. Puts it away as 50 with Brian. And Munchies is enough for Nettles to find an opening in the defense. A quick bounce shot, tuck it away. No mercy up three. 33 seconds remain. Back to that center line. Munchies pushes. On past Color Dino, but he ends up demoing the insurance follow up he had there. Dropped on down by Brian and Nettles. Nettles off the back wall looking for a center. Munchie just getting a piece of it. Keep that one on out. Spark no taking to the air. Spark no ends up getting 50 and this one plays back across. Bonnie back to that far side walk. Here's trying to be taken by Spark no, but Nettles intercepts and does end up finding it towards net much well enough to put this one on away. Still not going to end up making too much of a difference in the outcome of this game, but it always solves to not to try to give up any that. more momentum than you need to give in a series. Right now, LMU is going to need a lot of it as No Mercy putting themselves on match point. There is one more. This is a best of seven. So, here we go in to game four. No mercy needing one of the next four games to close it on out. LMU needing to pull it all the way back and pull off the reverse sweep if they want it in this series. As it looks like everyone is readied up. We wait for all players to get up into the lobby. There is five, six, and seven, so we should be good to go. Three A side, let's get game four underway. No mercy, trying to make this fast for them. And LMU trying to pull off the reverse sweep at this point. Nettles up for it, not quite finding it. It drops down to Monty, trying to make it met by Brian, and across this goes. Spark note, good high flick to that side. Ends up bumping a bit, trying to get back to it. Color Dino does well to this one on out and away. Namani met by Color Dino back in the orange side corner. It goes Ryan trying to fire a shot now, places it well just inside that near pipe and ends up putting no mercy up one. Could be a goal to finalize the series there if LMU cannot find an answer. Back to that center line. Brian and Amani meeting up. Color Dino plays by the oncoming corner attacker. Finds a demo and tries to push onwards. Munchies is least able to get back to it. Plays on out. Brian there, but Munchies does well to get back in the way of it. Amani trying to push on out. Oh, 
touch across far side. Spark Note flicks by another. Spark Note, a good play, but Brian Round able to at least get back and make the needed save. Monty pops this one up high. Brian Round trying to push onward. Spark Note takes off the sidewall now. Back on out. Color Dino pops this one high and across. Monty firing a shot that ends up going. Color Dino who plays back to that far side corner. Out of the far side corner, drops to Munchie. Munchie is bumped by Brian and pushed onward. Back off this goes Color Dino. Trying to advance it. Orange defense not allowed him to do so. Brian off the sidewall, bringing it up to the air. Kamani does well enough to keep this one to the side. Nettles now pushing towards the center. It looks like it's falling high. And Color Dino does well to tuck this one away on the aerial. Reed. We start Brian around love at this point. But Color Dino and Nettles finding success on that one as they hook up, putting no mercy up to. Might be living up to their name as they are full on showing up in this series, trying to close it on out. Munchie's going for the bump play, looking for the center. Throws it out there. Spark no, not quite finding this one. Brian now playing on forward. Met by Namani as Namani pushes this back in the blue side corner. LMU needing two here in the next 315 in order to at least keep their chance alive. Out this goes. Spark Note gonna find one here off the pass, off the back wall from Munchies. LMU now needing at least one more to extend their chance at a championship. 312 stills remains. Color Dino reporting the <laughs> Color Dino trying to get the bag. <laughs> Man, this is great. <laughs> Color Dino met by Namani. Namani trying to play up field. Metal takes possession there. Screw it. The entire team of No Mercy is all that they care about, but still, Spark Note not finding the save on that one. And Color Dino doing it his way to put this one back away. Spark Note not quite fun. Save on it, unfortunate play there as it puts No Mercy back up to LMU. Gonna need to find themselves at least two more goals if they want to extend their shot at a championship. Color Dino playing on out off that back wall now. Munchies able to push it on wide. Nettles back up. Spark No pushing it back on now. Brian off that sidewalk. Brian looking for the center, not quite finding it. Munchies playing on outwards. Nettles, please pop, man. Pop, maybe. Not quite able to do much. This color does end up getting back that one in time. Not allowing the orange attack to continue. Namani tries to play out, but Brian beats it well. This one pushes back to the orange side corner. Spark note now. Trying to take possession. Nettles off the back while looking for a center. Munchie pushes this one on outwards. Color Dino trying to get a play on it, but Munchies ends up really pushing out way high and across. This one goes. Spark now not finding it to the center. Munchies trying to take some possession, looking for the center pass one. Finds a bump, but not quite enough to push it all the way to the center. Up this one goes. Spark now finds a touch. Bounce shot. Gonna end up just wide. Able to get back to it across the net, but hits the far pipe, and Brian is able to clear that one on out. Spark now back to that sidewall. Munchies pushing past two. LMU fighting for everything that they have to try to make it to this championship. Color Dino. Brian ends up taking it from him. Spark Note backing the corner. Spark Note looking for it. Ends up finding a way past one, but Color Dino does well to clear. Color Dino trying to take a dribble now. Namani able to read that one and push it back to the corner. Namani off the side wall. Finds his way past two. Brian now still under it. Namani trying to dribble instead. Leaves it for Spark Note. Spark Note now off the back wall. Trying to find a center. Brian not allowing its way to find itself there. Nettles now pushing this back to the orange side corner. Out of the orange side corner. Namani and Nettles 50. And this goes all the way back into the blue side corner now. Munchie trying to find something. Color Dino as well to complete it. All the way. But Spark Note on the dive and at least able to dissuade that. Brian now the still there for it. Ends up 50 with Munchie back on down. Namani trying to get this one going forward. Munchie's now finding a dribble. Munchie tries to flick, doesn't quite find it. His color does well to push this one back on away. Spark Note off that sidewall. Color Dino up for it. Color looking to try to find that pass on out. Not quite finding it. Brian not making contact on that either. Munchie pinch back on out for Namani. Namani demoed by Brian. Spark Note pushing it into that far side corner now. Looking for the center play, but it's met by Nettles. That'll push it on outwards. LMU gonna need one relatively quickly. They're gonna have a shot to pull themselves back into this. The 
time keeps on ticking. Brian off the sidewall. Munchie's playing this one on outwards. Nettles not quite getting it, but Munchie's still needing to find some relatively fast. Barton will force that center. Nettles what does well to keep this on out. It looks like No Mercy living up to their name, trying to find that 4 0 oh, sweep as they triple commit this one in confidence. And it does end up falling back on down. No Mercy will end up taking this series and moving on to the championship. Expected from the fans. But as we can see, if we go back to this, I do know earlier in the comments, if I go all the way up, we know Felony Assault won their game. So, no mercy, you guys will be going on to play up against Felony Assault in the championship. And we will be seeing LMU at least taking on super fast loss, trying to get that third place. Expected. Wait, that was toxic. GG, everyone. Hey, sometimes the fans don't necessarily need to be biased. Caster, in my case, I will say. It's not like expected from my case. My case is always the, I like to see good Rocket League. I'm just a fan of the game. And that's the way that I am supposed to cast it. I'm supposed to be for both teams. Both teams making great saves, great plays when they make it. LMU had their moments on defense. They had some great moments on offense too, finding some really good dunks. Unfortunately for them tonight, No Mercy came into this one hot. No Mercy able to close it on out in that 4-0 sweep. We will end up having one more tonight, but that one is once again going to be at the top of the upcoming hour. So we will probably close it on out. I am going to look if there is another IGL caster that's live, as we do like to spread that love around during playoffs. It's always nice to get to see some people uh, out there casting it, keeping it going. I think we still probably do have Delco Dad. We might just go hit him back up again, as that is our second one. We will quick choose the prediction even though nothing was there for it no mercy did finalize this series thank you all for coming on out it was a blast to cast you guys we are going to probably end up going back to delco dead and uh allowing his cast to finalize up on the night so ggs to all and if you guys want to jump in and see a bit more igl rocket league we are heading over to delco's dad chat there ggs to you guys good luck on the championship no mercy and lmu good luck on that third place game Bye. As we start that raid. As we will be jumping on over there. Should be some good Rocket League going on over there. He has been casting well earlier today. He did cast the same team that I ended up casting as well. So that was kind of funny. But here we go on the way. You guys have a great rest of your night. And for those of you that end up coming on back, I will see you guys later for one more cast.